Well, many of you may have watched HGTV's show on Sunday called My Flippin' Friends. It's about this group of Milwaukee pros buying and rehabbing a house right here in our city. I love it. The episode was awesome and highlighted neighborhoods and landmarks all over Bruce City, and we are all hoping that the pilot becomes a series. And head designer Jenny Radosevich is back here on the Yellow Couch to give us a little insight and scoop about how it all went. So we're excited to know what kind of feedback you're getting from the show. Oh, what is up? Uh, hi, how are you? Oh, I wasn't here when you were here last I week. I know, we missed you. I was so excited that they're like, we're going to have her back. I was like, yes. <laughs> Great to see you. Good to see you too. So exciting, right? Yeah, I mean, this is, the, it kind of depends on how people react to the show. Right? Yeah, like you, you so know. far, I mean, Milwaukee's been amazing. Like, everyone rallied around us. The party was so great. So many people were there. It was insane, like, turning back and looking at everyone looking at the screen and laughing and being part of it. So, pretty exhilarating. So far, it's been really good. And, and it's a group of friends. I mean, how fun yeah. to work with your friends. I get to do it. I right get to now. do it. <laughs> like coffee talk. Um, yeah. You're with this group of friends. So, it's, you're all kind of pros in different areas. So, yep. one in real estate, yep. one in construction, DIY design. Mm -hmm. You bring to the table besides being super cute. Oh, thank you. What? <laughs> what do you bring? I'm, uh, I'm the DIY girl and then I'm the head designer. So, the overall vision of the house. House. I'm the one that wants them to do all these crazy things and they come back and they're like, we don't have enough money. Make it happen. Do you get us that budget? Yeah, I wondered that. Yeah, too. it's all real money. It's all, I, I, we, it's the budget's how much money we have to work with. Is so. it your money? It's Is your yeah. budget for yep. Oh, it's your show. money. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Right. So it's real money. It's all real. It's Do reality your television. Should give you an allowance as we talked about um, They should. <laughs> <laughs> I mean. So, so when you come up with a concept, how would you describe your vision for what yeah. you, you want in a home? Because I think it's really evolved. Like, I think when I was first married, it was all about traditional furnishings. And mm -hmm. I feel like people have really gotten away from that kind of look. And more contemporary furnishings are really seem to be in style now. Yeah. Yeah, this house was really fun to do because, honestly, there wasn't a lot that we could save. You know, a lot of Milwaukee has the dark wood, the built-ins, all those kind of things. And this didn't have anything we could this save. This bathroom, but... I love what you did with it. Is oh. that a... Is that a footed tub? Yep. Okay. Yep. Love it. Yeah. Love and it. So we could go really modern with this one, and I, I, I love it. Like we added this built-in for to have a little bit more character in the oh, house. Yeah. And I'm thinking this might be a den because there's just a lot of built-ins in this picture. It's all white, and it was wood paneling. Yeah. Which is horrible before. Yep. yep. That looks so bright and airy and fun. I Beautiful. love that. And then the staircase. And then we got to work with a lot of local, uh, you know, makers around here. A guy named Milwaukee Mike made that handrail, which is so beautiful. Um, yeah, I really love white, bright, open areas. Like since, the kitchen yes. is white now. Yep. I'm gonna just move your hair from your. Oh, there oh, it's on this side. <laughs> just because it's rubbing your mic a little. Yeah. There okay, honey. Okay. Beautiful uh, kitchen. Yeah, and this way too. You know, since it's a flip, people can come in if they want to add more paint colors. They can and change it up a little bit. But this really gives them a blank canvas to work with. So how does this work? So so you come in and you do this. A lot of other shows because people people love their HGTV. Yeah. I think if people love seeing a house flip and the transformation that what you did in the bedroom, like for example is unbelievable so other people who do it are couples maybe uh -huh. their siblings you guys are a group of friends and what's the concept so you've done this house now and yeah people here love it yeah what, what would be best case scenario so then they pick it up and yeah it becomes a whole series next year so we just found out we got the ratings in yesterday and they oh, were really they? good they were really good um we got all good, around the country we got good numbers all around the country um, I don't know if they can break it down by city but I'm sure Milwaukee was like off the charts yeah. and then um, we need people to keep commenting on HGTV's Facebook and keep asking for it. They are going to air it a couple more times, or at least once more, I know. Okay. And then we probably won't find out for another month if we get a full season, but would you go continue to flip in Milwaukee only? Or yep, you, in Milwaukee okay. only. only. The in whole Milwaukee. show is going to be based in Milwaukee. So one, per, one question I have is for people, because there are so many old built-ins and uh -huh. old character things, yeah. defining things about our architecture here. Do you think anybody should have guilt about that when, if they want to rip it out? Uh, it's so tough. Or paint it? I, I, I personally like the idea of painting it, which I feel like we, I would probably get a little flack about, but um, I wouldn't rip it out. It's it's so, but stick you know, paint on it. maybe a little paint <laughs> yeah. or refinish stick it paint or, paint. you know, sand it down and refinish it with a little bit more modern yeah. stain or something a little bit. OK, hipper. and I got to get yeah. personal a little bit because this also makes this show so fun. Look at you, how cute you are in your little <laughs> safety glasses. OK, yeah. so um, personal lives. One guy has a baby. Um, yes. His wife has a baby on this show. You actually have a date. Right? I did go on the show. Yeah, everyone keeps talking about that moment on it. It's so it's it's so funny because all the guys you know, have wives or girlfriends and Mallory and I are single, so they're like our dad figures being like <laughs> 
what's going on? Like, what's going on with your dating life? Was it's it a really setup or how did it come about? The date. Did, <laughs> I, mean, I don't. I think you should talk dating. more about it. Are you still dating? There's, the da guy? there's dating apps out there that you can use. <laughs> <laughs> See, Amy, okay. it's hard. There's a cliffhanger. See, Amy and I are dot like, dot dot. We're like dating apps. Oh, you can date on your phone. Oh what? my god. Yeah. <laughs> Alan says that in the episode. He's like, back in the day when I was going out, if you met someone on the internet, things were really shady. I'm like, that's, <laughs> that's how yeah. it works now. I'm Pretty a busy much. working woman. Like, I gotta. What? You, you gotta, gotta go to your phone. Right. Yeah. So get <laughs> a hookup. Right. I love it. Thank you. You're so sweet. I love you. I hope it becomes a um, series. Uh, we'd love it if you come back because yeah. we do DIY ideas. Yep. We'd love to see some of that. And there's this great website. And I also want to make sure that people know exactly what to do to help you. So the iSpyDIY.com is where people can find out about you, Jenny. That's my website. The show, yep. whatever. And now, I'm keeping people updated on my Instagram, on iSpyDIY Instagram. So if okay. you want more to know when it's going to air again. Now the hashtag my flipping friends help us here because we're not social well Amy's better on social oh, please media speak for yourself um, <laughs> so, <laughs> Facebook and Twitter yes. So how can people help you they, they go to the HGTV website yeah you go to their Facebook yep. page and Twitter like you can go it, to like HGTV's yeah Facebook Follow and go to, yeah Instagram. or I spy DIY yeah. and then just as much as many times as you use the hashtag they can track it okay and oh, just nice. see that it's being used I'm gonna use it today when I post on Facebook <laughs> on FB it's gonna be awesome <laughs> It's so great to have you Good come to back see you anytime. Too. We'd Thanks. love to Bye, see you Jen. again. <laughs> that was awesome.